it is phenomenal that what people say when they first hear about the latest KTL's battery technology, new LFP Gen 3 EV battery pack, which has a nearly 1 million miles, zero degradation through the first 1,000 cycles, the warranty period is two times higher before capacity drops to 85%. This is a far cry from the 70% retained capacity that other EV makers now give after their typical eight-year warranties expire. This new 15-year EV battery is definitely a combination of leading-edge technologies at present. How will KTL become a game-changer? Let's find out in today's episode. If you think EV battery packs are only warrantied for a few years, you're wrong. Recently, after delivering EV packs with a 12-year lifespan for NIO, the leading EV battery maker CATL released its new breakthrough battery pack with incredible mileage up to a nearly 1 million mile and admirable 15-year warranty. More surprisingly, according to the company, the new long-lasting EV battery has zero degradation through the first 1,000 cycles. As a result, many drivers hold the view that it is phenomenal. In particular, CATL unveiled its new LFP Gen 3 EV battery pack, which has a 932,000 miles, 15-year warranty before capacity drops to 85%. This is a far cry from the 70% retained capacity that other EV makers now give after their typical 8-year warranties expire. This new 15-year EV battery is probably a product of perfecting existing technologies. Back to last year, CATL unveiled its new Shenxing Superfast Charging Battery. The new LFP battery can add 248 miles range in 10 minutes. Then, it also launched another world's first LFP battery, with 4C ultra-fast charging for 370 miles in 10 minutes, and over 620 miles range called Shenxing Plus. This time, more interestingly, this improvement might add up to 500 miles range in 10 minutes. According to KATL, to achieve this leapfrogging of charging speed, this kind of battery applies technologies including fast lithium-ion conductive coating, the addition of transition metal elements, and new nanometer encapsulation, rendering smoother and more efficient energy transmission between cathode and anode materials. KTL has expanded the overcurrent area and capacity of the terminals in the battery system to rapidly dissipate heat during high current charging. In terms of BMS core algorithms, KATL's newly developed AI polarization model can predict and control the charging current in real time, enabling faster and smarter energy replenishment. Moreover, in January, CATL itself said it would reduce the cost of this LFP Gen 3 battery cells per kW by a whopping 50% by the middle of this year. So, let's take a small calculation. If the price of one kilowatt for a Tesla 4680 battery is $120, the price of this groundbreaking battery is only about $60 as KTL's promise, only $10 higher than the cost of one kilowatt for sodium ion battery. As a result, with the price just as affordable as natri ion batteries, the manufacturers and customers can enjoy the super advancements with a budget-friendly price that have never happened in others. It is clear that this approach has allowed KTL to release new battery types faster while still serving its numerous customers like the leading EV manufacturers. Tesla are never left twiddling their thumbs waiting for the next big things that are years away from commercialization. Why is this new battery from CATL a breakthrough for the EV industry in particular and all industries in general? The launch of the advanced CATL battery marked a revolutionary turning point for the electric vehicle industry, especially for buses, Tesla, Semi, and Cybertrucks. This groundbreaking battery offers enormous potential, not only promising to transform the entire transportation industry, but also bringing huge benefits to consumers, automakers, and the environment. In the following minutes, we will review some potential applications of the new CATL battery that no other battery in history has been able to do. 1. Electric buses, of course. Currently, electric buses often have limited range, ranging from about 125 to 300 miles depending on size, 
making them unsuitable for long routes. The new Kia TL battery can help electric buses travel 4 MR5 times farther than today, significantly expanding application possibilities and operational efficiency. In a 2016 document outlining a broad 10-year strategy for Tesla, Musk highlighted the importance of electrifying both trucking and transit. In addition to consumer vehicles, there are two other types of electric vehicle needed, heavy-duty trucks and high-passenger-density urban transport, he wrote. He was right. Electrifying the country's buses has become a primary goal for transit agencies. Buses travel through densely populated cities, exposing everyone around them to toxic fumes. Electrification also saves cities money since they cost less to maintain and require fewer repairs. And adding more reliable, efficient electric buses also brings with it the potential to get more drivers out of their own emissions spewing vehicles, delivering cleaner air and less congestion. According to statistics, there's also plenty of opportunity for Tesla bus when a recent survey showed that only 4,600 electric buses in the United States, in which California takes the lead with over 1,600 units now. And Bloomberg Neff predicts that electric bus sales in the United States are expected to reach 5,000 units in 2024 and increase to 30,000 units in 2025. Furthermore, the operating costs of electric buses are inherently lower than fossil fuel buses. The use of new Kai TL batteries with longer life will help reduce battery replacement costs, providing significant savings for bus operators. Electric buses have zero emissions, contributing to reducing environmental pollution and improving air quality, especially in big cities. If all of these buses were equipped with new KTL batteries, the city could save more than $1 billion in operating costs each year and significantly reduce CO2 emissions. Besides, CATL launched the battery pack with Yutung Bus Co. to power commercial vehicles, not only buses, but also different classes of trucks, as Yutong, one of China's largest bus makers, said the new battery packs will be used in upcoming electric vehicles. We can see that this bus manufacturer also introduced another battery with a 10-year and 621,000 miles. Yutong's buses feature CATL batteries in decades and are already sold in over 40 different countries, including Italy, France, the UK, Spain, and Qatar. Furthermore, NIO announced a partnership with CATL to develop long-life EV batteries. This could spearhead the used EV market as more than 20 million electric cars will start coming out of warranty in the next few years. The news comes as NIO's first 900V electric drive system rolled off the production line last week with a 5-minute fast charge that can add 150 miles range.